a very strong, a very talented, and a very well-matched field of top-class free-for-allers for the presidential final. $121,000 on the line, and here they come. And they're off. First away is Dakota Express for the lead. Soho is sprinting out on the way again. Floats out of there for Campbell looking for position and three hours will sit up close early. He slides up into third on the inside. Daylon Trooper has come away racing in fifth. ED's Cam has on the way against cover to follow. He's second over and Gallo Blue Chip joins the flow right now. Dubay gets him off the pylons third over. Racing in eighth is McDillon, followed up by Who's Your Boy, and St. George Island is the trailer. The opening quarter, 27 and three. Silverman grabs a hold of Soho, and on the way again, presses on, and it's on the way again, who now takes the lead, and three olives moving right now for Miller on the outside. So on the way again is in front, and three olives is coming first over, and he's being chased along, applying the pressure. Soho now back in third, Dakota Express fourth. Ed's Cam just sitting there on the outside as three olives will clear the lead. Daylon Trooper is sixth on the inside. Gallo Blue Chip second over with cover seventh. McDillon follows him 54 and two, the half mile time. Racing in ninth is Who's Your Boy? He's fourth over right now. At the back of the pack is St. George Island and three Alas with an explosive backside burst is a length in front. Racing in second is on the way again who sits in and ED's Cam is getting serious. He's rushing up on the outside and that puts Gallo in a perfect striking spot. He looms the danger second over right now as the they race past the three-quarter marker in 123 and two and come to the top of the stretch in the presidential. It's three olives who's digging in on the inside. Edie's Cam surging by to the lead on the outside. On the way again with room at the rail and Gallo Blue Chip kicks off cover. Edie's Cam in front, a 16th out. Gallo Blue Chip is there. McDillon on the far outside toward third. Edie's Cam is game. Gallo Blue Chip, one last surge is coming. Gallo getting up. Gallo Blue Chip, the four million dollars horse in 151 and 1. 2000 horse of the year, the 2000 Meadowlands Pace winner Gallo Blue Chip on his way back to the winner's circle. New York bred six year old gelding now by Magical Mike out of Camatross by Albatross, all by Martin Scharf of Lawrence, New York. Mark Ford has done such a great job managing his career. And Danielle Dubay with these newfound off the pace tactics gets Gallo up in the final strides to take the $121,000 presidential final. Gallo, already the richest pacer in history, topping the $4 million mark. And he's done it the hard way, week in and week out against the best the sport has to offer. Gallo Blue Chip is the 2003 presidential champion. Standing by in the winner's circle, Tom Bruno, Bob Herbster, Linda Sebasti, and Joan Esposito. They will handle the trophy presentation duties to the winning connections, Martin Scharf, trainer Mark Ford, and winning driver, Danielle Dubay. Number one, Gallo Blue Chip pays four dollars two sixty two ten. Second, the two Ed's Cam eight dollars three even. And third, number eight on the way again two forty to show one two exacta twenty six forty and the one two eight trifecta seventy eight dollars and twenty cents. The winner circle ceremonies continue for the presidential final. Our man Bob Hollywood Hayden will speak with the winning connection shortly, but it is official. And it's Gallo Blue Chip tapping the $4 million mark, a special commemorative sign to recognize his achievements and certainly an accomplishment of great satisfaction for Mark Ford, owner Martin Scharf, and Danielle Dubay. First, tell us a little bit about the trip tonight. Well, you got, you got a great trip, and you know, from behind. And if you have the chance to go to the front, don't matter. Right now, he's good. You, know, you can race everywhere, you know. Is he reminiscent? Is he like the Gallo a couple years ago? Yeah, he come back like the Gallo. He's, he, that's him. He's always good, you know. When okay, Marty Scharf, you and Mark Ford got together after a three-year-old season, got together, got Gallo Blue Chip. What were you thinking at that moment? Uh, well, we, we just wanted to have a good horse. You know, we didn't have too many good horses before Gallo, and we would just, just wanted a good, solid horse. We obviously never thought that this we'd be standing here right now. Got a New York bred gelding, won two million dollar races. The first patient hit four million dollars. Give us what was the best stop or two along the way? Meadowlands Pace, without a doubt. 
the absolute best. You, you don't get better than that in this business. For me, maybe one day something, maybe the Hamiltonian one day, but uh, but the metal in space. Four million, is there anything else on the horizon for him, you think? Well, as long as he, Mark will tell you, as long as he races sound and, and he competes with the best horses, then, uh, then that would be fine with, with us. You know, if he starts to wear down, then, then I'm sure that me and Mark will uh, decide at that time to, you know, to retire him. Okay, Mark Ford, how much work has it been to keep Gallup Blue Chip on top of his game? It's been one of the greatest things that's ever happened to me, but it really makes you think on how lucky we really are. Um, <laughs> this is really the biggest achievement, you know, I think any horse has ever made to race four or five years here at the Meadowlands, and it's just been unbelievable, and I'm just glad that we had the opportunity to do it. Any possibility we're going to see him continue on here uh, later on in the season, uh, the Horton, those kind of big races, or we'll wait and see on that? Well, it's just one thing we have to take one step at a time. He's uh, really been lucky to come back uh, the way he is now, and uh, I'm just, we've been waiting for this for a long time, and I'm just so glad to get it over with, but this, uh, this really uh, puts his place in history, I think, so. Okay, congratulations, all the connections. Gallup Blue Chip has done it, the first Meadowlands Pace winner to win the presidential and the first Pacer to top $4 million.